So I left resin sitting in my resin 3D printer for 14 months after I was injured. So after a lengthy recovery, I decided to run a test. I wanted to put fresh, unopened resin head to head versus 14 month old resin that had set abandoned in the bath of my 3D printer. So the first thing we need to do is actually remove the old resin from the old printer's bath. Now, as you can see, this resin is extremely separated. I removed the resin vat from the printer and drained it into a glass beaker so that we could all look to see what that looked like. I decided that for best results, I should filter the resin before trying to print with it. I poured the resin from the beaker through a filter and this process was painstakingly slow. At this point, the old resin was set aside. I got a bottle of fresh new resin. I actually purchased a brand new printer to run this experiment with. So first up was the fresh resin. I ran Curic time calibration tests on the fresh resin. This gives us a baseline for detail, exposure, and layer consistency. The prints came out clean, crisp, and exactly what you would expect from a brand new printer using a brand new bottle of resin. I went ahead and sent a test file of the John Snow through the printer. The print came off the printer flawlessly. I washed and cleaned it up in my wash and cure machine. It looks great. Level of detail is insanely clear. Just what I would expect coming off of any modern resin printer. So with the old resin, I started by crossing my fingers and then I thoroughly remixed the resin before pouring it back into the resin vat. Here you can watch the results of that print take place. Once the print was finished, I go ahead and remove the print from the print bed. We send it through our wash and cure machine. So here's the side by side. Can you tell which one's which? I'll put a close up view of the two models. All right, what's your guess? The one on the right is the old resin. The one on the left is the new resin. It's hard to tell the difference. The results for both were excellent. Honestly, you'd be hard pressed to pick them apart if you didn't know better. Looking at them up close, I can tell that the old resin does tend to have more of a gloss or a sheen left over. As far as detail goes, there's not a lot of difference. The supports came off equally as easily for both. They washed basically as easily as both. There are not really any imperfections or noticeable layer lines on either of these prints. So you've got old resin sitting around, don't toss it. Just stir it, filter it, maybe mix it with a little bit of new resin and give it a shot. 